Good morning, friends. Today we'll be reading another Pete the Cat story, our last one of this week. This one is called Pete the Cat and the Bedtime Blues. It's written by Kimberly and James Dean. Here we go. Pete and the gang had a great day. They'd been at the beach. Surf and sun and tons of fun. But when the sun went down, they didn't want the fun to end. Pete had an idea. Hey, how about a sleepover? Groovy. Pete's place, let's go. The party was far out, but they knew they couldn't stay up all night. What were they doing when they had their party? Let's see. What do you see in the pictures, friends? I see a hot pizza. I see the motorcycle, a soccer ball. <gasps> Looks like um, a walkie-talkie, a car, some drums. Pete's doing some art. There's a lot going on at the party. But now they decided it's time for bed. The gang decided it was time to say goodnight. On went the pajamas and out went the light. Good night, Gus. Good night, alligator. Good night, Toad. Good night, Pete. Pete was just about to catch some Z's when clap, clap, clap. <gasps> Who did that? It was me, said Grumpy Toad. I don't want to go to bed. I want to clap instead. Pete covered his head. This cool cat needs to go to bed. Good night, Gus. Good night, alligator. Good night, toad. Good night, Pete. Time to go to sleep. Rat a tat tat. Rat a tat tat. <gasps> Who did that? Pete asked. It was me, said Gus the Platypus. I don't want to go to bed. I want to jam instead. Get the drums out. Pete covered his head. This cool cat needs to go to bed. Time to sleep. Good night, Gus. Good night, alligator. Good night, Toad. Good night, Pete. Pete closed his eyes to catch some Z's when he heard. What are we going to hear next, friends? Let's find out. Munch, munch, munch. Pete had a hunch. It was alligator. He was always up for eating. What could Pete do? All the clapping and the rat-a-tat-tatting and the munching was giving him the bedtime blues. Pete had a groovy idea. He got out his favorite bedtime story and started to read. First to himself and then to the gang. What's he reading? Let's look. It says, Pete the Cat and the Little Monsters. You see that on the cover, friends? Pete noticed it was finally quiet. No more clapping, no more rat-a-tatting, and no more munching. They all settled down. No one made a sound. Pete yawned and turned off the light. Good night, sleep tight. Time to catch some Z's. Z is everyone sleeping. Let's look. Shh. Mm -hmm. Looks like everyone but Pete's asleep. Tomorrow was another day for surfing sun, and tons of fun. 
Okay, that's it. Bye friends.